Sorry guys, I had the microphone off again. So, welcome to another rattlesnake, which I've done. I've changed it a lot, as you've probably just seen on there without any sound. I've changed, she's been changed to a top. She's got top fitting with Caldera Navy top launchers. I've given her Tech 2 uh, shield reinforcers, uh, rigs. She's got True Sanchi cap power relay there, gives her 25% more. And I've gone with a passive tank. So depending on what I get from the uh, from the agent. Okay, and a missile guidance computer which gives you a range of, when it's running, 36. 36 kilometers. That's why I've put this on, really just to get me up close and personal when I need to. Um, when this is running, it is still cap stable, so that's awesome. It's a 500 mn micro just just x and when that's off and that's running i've got six and a half minutes so i've got a decent amount of time you still have to micromanage this but should be good and resists if it's a kinetic and thermal mission then i've got a kinetic 91 thermal 81 which is pretty damn decent okay so anyway let's Let's see what she's got to offer us. And then we'll go from there. Anomic base. What a surprise. Anomic agent. No. Let's request. Yay! Anomic team. So we're not even going to do it in the rattlesnake. We're going to jump into the gamma. And I am going to pull up my guide, the Gamma Fit. Well, not the Gamma Fit, but just what ammo. And it's a, it's a Hawk. So the Hawk, uh, you orbit it at 20 kilometers. You use, uh, for the Lodgy ships, Navy, Molnia, and for the, for the Hawk itself, Monia Rage. So we'll accept that. <clears throat> That's a nice little start. Where is it? Okay. So we're in, and all we do with the gamma is just uh, speed tank it. So I don't know if any of you guys know Hateless. That's one of his. This is the. This is his. Um, his information here. Brilliant. He's passed away since, which is very, very sad. Um, I'm just trying to remember how he passed away. That's sad. It really is. Anyway, I'll move that back up there, and we'll get on our way. Drive active. Hmm. Yeah, so he, uh, somebody said, I'm sure he said he might have died on a motorbike. I don't know. I do apologise if I'm totally wrong, but uh, it's very sad. Okay, so... Let's have a look. I'm just going to, uh, sorry guys, I'm just doing something right now, it won't be too long. Okay. 
Okay, let's get to that system. Warp drive active. Oh, excuse me. That's fine. Okay, yeah. So we'll get this done. We did accept. Yes, we did. Okay, so <clears throat> all we do is it's the Hawk, so we orbit it at 20 kilometers. There's four ships there's a Jaguar, there's a Vengeance, there's a Hawk, and there's an Enyo. The Jaguar is the only one you orbit at 26 kilometers, all the rest you do at 20 kilometers. So when you warp in, you orbit this, the main ship, the Jaguar, Jaguar, the Vengeance, the Hawk or the Enya, whatever it is. Uh, and then you take out the Lodger ships one by one, switch your ammo out to the other damage type, uh, and then take out the, the main ship. And that's it. Job done. And you get 12,000... 900 loyalty points I spent most of mine I bought a Navy Raven and it's and sold it just wanted to do just balance off fork it out for the uh, rattlesnake I put a load of stuff I don't use back on the market, so I've sold quite, quite a bit of that now. Where is it? I've sold quite a bit there. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Let's go to the location. It's always a gate, so uh, or acceleration gate. So uh, let's get everything on now. Guidance computers are on. Excuse me. And let's go. Warp drive active. There's the Hawk. And it is 20. Yep. Okay. So let's lock them all up. And as you can see, I've got no tank whatsoever. It literally is a speed tank. And let me just double check what I need on for the Hawk. Navy Molnir, okay. Uh, there we go. Oh, he's a little bit out of the way. So we'll have him. Hmm. Right, <clears throat> and here we go. Don't know why he was out of range. So Navy Molnir and then Molnir Rage, Rage. <laughs> the missiles but the sound sound almost like auto cannons so once this one drops the other one is defense will stand because he can't rep himself <clears throat> and then the hawk is obviously defenseless as well well when it comes to repping anyway because <laughs> he'd rip me a new one if I stopped Yeah. 
Yeah, it shouldn't last. Shouldn't last too long. Yep, and now we switch to rage. And then we kill this big boy. Little boy. He's trying to hit me. <laughs> Look at his missiles. <laughs> there we go. Well, his rockets. And he might drop something. Uh, he might drop something. He normally doesn't, but he has dropped a few things um, before now. Some juicy bits, but I never... Uh, I never really uh, bank on it. Let's go to it. See what there is. And absolute rubbish, so I'm not even going to bother. Just trying to think, where is it? Uh, Who's that one? Okay, let's go. So that's done, so we'll just weigh that in, and then we'll see what else she offers us. Yeah, so a Nomic team, guys. You can do that one with, with the Gamma. Um, that setup from Hateless is for a Gamma. And it gives you the fit and everything. Uh, I will put the link in after, after we've finished. I'll put the link in. But it's Eve Workbench. Brilliant. And that is actually suitable for alphas as well, guys. You know, alpha, an alpha account. Which is pretty damn good. Just imagine uh, if you had a few level fours in a system, different stations, and you just went one to another to another, just doing anomic teams. My god. It has been done. We used to do it in um, in what's it? Catch. I can't bloody remember now. Let's have a look. We used to do it in Geo. Where's Geo? Geo. Yeah. Let's have a look. In Curse. Catch. Curse. Uh, we used to do it there. There's plenty of stations there. That was brilliant. And you could, uh, you could refuse. Obviously, you can refuse one. Anything after that, you you had to wait 24 hours. But if you went round them all, you could, in theory, have quite a few anomic teams to do all at once, which is what quite a few lads did. Earn your money that way. Okay. <clears throat> That's a nice little uh, ten minute mission. For all those loyalty points, like I said, I've spent most of mine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I 
I love how it tells you every, everything now in that little that little mission window. You never used to get that. A lot of missions you just had to guess what you were doing. Very little help. Me. You want him head off here. I don't know why. I think we will just drop those down. Get those out of the way. Okay, let's get to the station. Warp drive active. I don't know why there's, there's a delay on the YouTube side from me transmitting to you guys, well, well to my studio window, or the YouTube studio window. It's about a five second delay, but if I look at Twitch, it's instant. It's as live as I am now. Very strange. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Always had a delay. <clears throat> okay, let's let's complete the mission. Excellent. So I've only got eighty thousand loyalty points now, as opposed to seven hundred odd thousand. Right, so let's request a mission. Right hand of Razmataz. That's quite a decent one. So let's bring up the mission guide. Right hand of Razmataz. There it is, it's mercenaries, and it is kinetic and thermal to deal. Uh, resist is thermal and kinetic. If I remember rightly, I think it, I think it's more kinetic than thermal to resist as well, but anyway. So there we are, we have quite a few. Ah, they drop insignia. And they drop in narcotics. Um, yeah. Not exactly uh, busy, but so it's been blitzed in an Ishtar, done in a Nightmare, done in an AV APOC, uh, done in a Dommy, done in a, done in a Raven Navy, a Sentry Dommy, a Gila, and a Manticore. But they've done the blitz in a Manticore, I was going to say. Okay. Manticore's a tiny little bomber, but. It can certainly deal out that DPS with torps. Okay. So, we'll accept it. Let's swap out into the um, Rattler. Just double check what I've got. I've got Scourge in, that's fine. Don't know, I have nothing in there though, so we need to. And I think I'm good on there as well, can I to confirm? We'll see how we go. Uh, just need to get some tops in. Caldar Navy Scourge. And we'll put 7,000 in. And we'll. Yeah, I've got no javelin, so that's it. We're just going to have to use them. Okay. So it's in a mucket. <laughs> so let's do it. Right, this will be a... Uh... Oh, hello. 
This will be a test of uh, of the ship's worth. Let's warp to location. Thirty thirty six kilometers. Jesus. That's all I've got on the tops. When the Nita's in a bomber, she is a lot more, I think seventy five kilometers than a bomber and a manticore. Anyway, we shall see how this goes. Do I have to kill everything? Dest destroy the headquarters. Right. Okay. And there's Zor. I'm just I'm just gonna have to go in. Wow. Just gonna go up that way. I mean, my signature radius now will be like the size of a small moon. <laughs> okay, so now Zor. Let me get these back in. Let's get them grouped up. I'm going to drop. I'm going to drop the wasps and kill some of these little ones. I've got most of the aggro now. Right, Zor's nearly dead. He's dead. Okay, and we have to kill the compound, uh, destroy the compound as well. Okay. Wow. Need to get rid of that one. He's nice and close, which he will love. My carriers love being up close and personal. And he really is right, right up my bum. Because he'll outrun this. I mean, the carriers are pretty, well, one of the fastest. And look at the DPS going down on him. He is gone. Well, that's pretty damn good, if you, if you ask me. Right, these two are getting hit. They seem to be, they seem to be okay right now. They are getting hit, but they are coping. Where are they? Okay. Yeah, they're getting some aggro. Gonna have to pull him in before he dies. He's probably gonna die before he gets here. Son of a bitch. Yep. Okay. I'll get the aggro and then I'll uh, pop them back out. Right, let's pop them back out.
Let's put them on the lights. Get rid of the lights. Ooh. I think we should just have a look at Zor's wreck, wherever it is. So look at that one. Let's see what's in there, shall we? So the passive tank is doing really well. I'm impressed with that, actually. Let's get to this wreck. So those two little ones are out of range, but I'll leave I'll leave them to the, uh, the to the um, wasps. Okay. Actually, he's in range now. There's Zord's wreck. We'll go to that as well. I don't think there's anything. Where's her wreck? Oh, there it is. Sometimes you get um, in the Zorak, you get two, you get um, an implant. Sometimes it's just a crappy one. Sometimes it's decent. So we'll have a look at that. I'll let the boys sort him out. Excellent. Well done. And I will have to destroy the uh, headquarters. Oh, that's new to me. Uh, DNA. I think that's it, really. So I'll put the drones on that while I go for Zor's wreck. Wherever he is. So it is one of these here. I'm sure it was. There it is. Okay. Be a navigation. If it's a hyperlink, then that's the expensive one. No, it's just a crappy one. As I'll take it anyway. And take that, and that's about it. And they've popped it. Nice one. That is complete. Are they back in yet? Yeah. Okay. So that was pretty painless. I'm impressed. I'm impressed with the passive tank. I'd say that was actually... Well, we'll see. We'll see on other missions, but I'd say that was actually better than the active tank. <laughs> but I lost a wasp. But hey, these things happen. <clears throat> these things happen, don't they? So, yeah, I don't know what you think, guys, about the initial outing for the we say the re-fitted uh, rattlesnake. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Anyway, let's let's. Uh, thank you. We're done. Uh, let's request another mission. Intercept the saboteurs. It's Garista's, it's next door. Right, in, uh, intercept the saboteurs. Let's have a look. 
on the mission guide just to be sure where is it and it's Gurist, isn't it? Intercept the saboteurs. Kinetic and thermal, as we knew. Quite a bit, quite a bit of jamming, and the usual from the frigates. Okay. Money-wise, loot is 1.2. Salvage is blah blah blah. Hardly worth anything, and. You can you can blitz it, kill all the ships in the entry room, use the gate call, kill all the ships in group two, collect the viral and return to agent. Well Is that a blitz? Anyway. Let's bang it back up there. And we're kinetic and thermal, so we're good. I think we'll be good for uh, ammo. Let's get rid of it. Yeah, we're good for ammo. I'll just put some in just in case. Okay. And she wanted us to... She wanted us to... Literally intercept the transport ships, and that's it. Okay. Warp drive active. Somebody want to kill those garistas? Those little frigates? Oh, I think he's going. Yeah, he is. <laughs> Have fun. I haven't bought a skin for it yet. See how we go. If it stays, then uh, I'll buy it a skin. I want to. Um, I want to get a Macarial, but Anita can't really fly those. It's Fozzy who can fly those. He can do level fours here, so. Uh, We'll have him, uh, I think we'll have him in Mac Macario. But I'll have a look at a fit for that. <laughs> Do love those ships, they're so fast as well. So I'm just going to sit her here, get the aggro and just drop the drones. There we go. And away they go. 
Should make uh, light work of these lights. <coughs> Let's see if they switch their uh, their dam their damage to the drones. Mm. Yep, there you go. They switched damage to the drones. One of them, anyway. And he's about to die. He's dead. <laughs> He'll be dead in a second. There you go. And the last one. Sweet. I mean, the DPS from the drones is 405. That's, that's not bad, guys. It's nice. And now we can... We can go... Drive active. <laughs> there we go. So let's have a look. That's quite a lot of ships there. So I'm going to go this way, try and get the attention of just, just this group. Okay. I love it. I love the speed of this. Awesome. No way am I in range yet, but... So, no aggro, yeah. That's how we like it. There you go. Ah, got bloody aggro from them as well. Damn, 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 damn. Right, we need to start. Ooh. These feroxes will die pretty quick. Right, so we're going to have to uh, quickly work our way through these. Drop the drones. I'm going to put them on the very small. No, I think they are. Nah, they're doing their own thing. I'll let them as long as they don't aggro those over there. Let's wrap her up a bit. Need to get some of these lights locked up. Okay, oh, they're getting hammered. The drones are getting some attention now. Sweet. 
we we'll bring them back in before they get popped. Let's get this obliterator scene too. So he's just in he's just in range now. Come on. Rips through them, these tops. Love these tops. Sweet. So I'm going to uh, put some on some of these. I don't need all the launchers together. There we go. Gonna lock that little one and that little one. Drop the drones. Get them on those. Because these are so easy now. Sweet. Get the drones on him. Get a few more on these. They're a bit. The gila's a bit tougher. <clears throat> cool. Get those on the gila. Just one on him. to burn towards them in a minute. The drones are getting attention again. There's the transport ships, so I'll leave those. Keeping on the drones. Drones are doing a sterling job. That's some damage. Just in range. But I need to lock all these up now. Ah, he's out of range. I'm going to get him closer now. Get the drain, uh, drones on those little ones now. Let's have him. Nice one. Sweet. Certainly a test of the uh, of the rattlesnake's metal. A module has run out of charges. A module has run out of charges. Come on, drones, kill him. Taking the time with that one. A module has run out of charges. Sweet. I'm going to leave those two right now. I really need both drones on that. Then 
the trouble with tops is they're so slow compared to crews or you know or uh, heavy assault let's get the drones on these I need to get to these guys. So many lights, ridiculous. Killing them. I mean, the drones are killing the lights as fast as they can. Let's get that on him. Cool. Need to keep those drones on the move. behind that drone they're not letting off him I have to bring him back I'll bring him back in before they start dying again sweet they're both in I'll, I'll drop them back out in a minute Christ how many transport ships are there Jeez. <laughs> Not got all the aggro yet. I'll uh, see how I go. Sweet. Now I have, so I'll launch both drones. In fact, I'll launch these two that are not damaged. Well, it's going about as good as I can expect, guys. Let's get the drones, they'll take the uh, that raven out. Get a few of these on this. have a quick boost of the shield. I mean, they, uh, they hit hard. Look at that, that raven. Sweet. to spread my damage if you you don't want to waste you know a whole uh, salvo on on a th small ship seems crazy like that now I'd rather have it on something else but you see look at that there's way too many so I'll put two on him and two on him I'll put three on him actually. Oh no, won't put any because they're not in range. 
just going to reload everything while I'm uh, waiting. I'll send the drones. I'll just send the drones to them. Go on, boys. Kick ass. May as well kill these now. So it's just viral, uh, viral agent 60 off. <laughs> right, let's get to that. That's no, nope, we don't crash. Ah, it's going to be that one there, look. Yeah, there it is. That's all we want. We do not want the crash. As soon as you pull on your cargo and you uh, go through a gate, guess what? Concord don't like it. Right, let's get the drones in and get off. <laughs> Oh, that was pretty good, guys. I was impressed with that. The passive fit works so much better. The passive top fit works a lot better. Right, let's go. Warp drive active. I'll repair that wasp as well while I'm in the station. Yeah, if you carry uh, illegal drugs in your cargo, you get warm by Concord. They tell you to uh, get rid of them quick. Unless that's changed, going back a few years since I had some. Warp drive active. So if any of you guys have got a rattlesn rattlesnake fit out there, I don't mind looking at it. You can certainly have a look at this one. Uh, I must admit, I am impressed. I'm impressed with this. That's not a massive amount of money, 2.8 billion. That is not a lot. Not a lot at all. And you saw how easy she could tank all out. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Okay. Hmm. Have I? Oh, I'll tell you what, let's just... Yeah, that's cool. We've got all those, I don't know what they are, but... Ooh. That looks good. Look at that, 91% on the kinetic, jeez. 
and the damage has gone up. Okay, um, let me just repair that. To... It's only a drone. Have I got any more drones? Or was that it? Uh, no more wasps. Okay. Let's see if there's any on the market. Kaka Keller. Nah. Yeah. 2.6. <laughs> Jeez. That's a bit of a. They've doubled up there. Anyway. No big deal, I've got five, that's fine. Can we have two out at a time? Let's have another mission. Let's see what she gives us. Pirate Slaughter. Now that's going to be... It's Garistas again, we don't need to change anything. It's, it's in the system. Just need to just check my ammo. Should be fine. I'll have to get some javelin. <laughs> Anyway, uh, yeah, did I accept it? Yeah, we're good. We go. Let me just bring that up. There it is. So we hunt down the enemy, destroy them all, and that's it. But it looks like it's going to be a tough one. I thought I'd repaired that flipping. Oh, seriously. Docking permission requested. Docking request repaired that accepted. drone. There you go. Okay. Let's go, let's warp. Get that on. Pirate Slaughter, 8,600, so that's one of the tough ones. Definitely going to be one of the tough ones. Don't get caught on the gate. Drive active. Right, let's see what there is. Okay, so I'm just going to over the gate, let them come to me. I think we may have some spawns from here. Nah. I'll get rid of them first. Because that, I'll just put one launcher on each of these. That's all I need to do for these tissue size, tissue bloody thickness ships. 
They really are made out of tissue. Okay. Let's kill these three. There we go. That, that one. Right, let's group these up now. Got to remember my range. There you go, there's some... some lights. Let's drop the wasps. They can have the little ones. Getting jammed here. Need to sort him out. They'll keep just shooting. Uh, they'll probably go for the jammer, to be honest. Anyway. Hopefully they'll uh, kill the light that's uh, scramming. Yep, he's gone. So I need to bring these in. Because they're going to get some aggro in a minute. Sweet. Let's drop them again. Get these two locked. <clears throat> Four two two five flipping heck. Right, those two on the lights. So all the aggro's on me right now, so that's good. At least I leave the drones alone. <laughs> Flipping eggs ripping through them. Jeez. Keep the drones on them. They're all nicely in range for me. Sweet, now they can do what they want. All the aggro's on me. Those tops are awesome. Love them. We look at that straight through his shields into his armor. First salvo. Jeez. I just love this DPS. Amazing. Still no DPS on the drones, that's good. <clears throat> They're just melting. They really are just melting. This rattlesnake is, uh... oh, sugar. 
It's out of range, stupid. I need to burn towards these. Might as well reload. I'll catch up to you. Drones are doing a good job. And you're in range. Here they come. That's two salvos. Three, he's nearly dead on three. That is damn good. That is pretty damn good. I'll just help the drones. Not that they need any help. <laughs> and there they go. Might as well reload while I'm waiting for the drones to come back. Okay. Let's do this. Warp drive active. Again, I'm going to stick around the acceleration gate and hopefully they'll come to me. Well, he's close, so he's going to get it straight away. Christ is right on top of me. Boom. Just like that, he's dead. So I'm going to start to get some aggro now. There's a start to come. I've got all the aggro, so I'll drop the wasps and uh, get those on the cruisers, battle cruisers. So another spawn as well. Keep them on these battle crews. 
is these, I think the diapithems um, jam. But so do the big boys, but I'll get rid of those. now boom straight through his shields another salvo straight through his armor another one and he's dead three salvos that's all it took to kill him get some repping done Okay, so they're getting some love in and the drones from uh, on these two cruisers, so I'm going to put them on them. I'm going to let them kill him first, though. Blimey. God, I love this top setup. Finish him off. Cool. I'll put him on them now. Should be fine. Once they're orbiting the um, diapithems, they're the ones that are aggroing, so they should be fine. Oops, wrong one. I love the tops. Straight through. Snakes aren't lasting long. <laughs> Literally three salvos and they're dead. That's crazy. One, that's two, cheese, and that's three. Sweet, get the drones in. Reload. Come on, boys. They're so slow. <coughs> Come on, Jesus. <laughs> Finally. Do I need to pick anything up? No, I just need to kill them all, though. Yeah. Just kill them all. This is the last room.
just going to burn in a bit. And I'll orbit that at about 15. Ooh, that's nice. 12 million. <clears throat> Let's get them all locked up now. There we go. In range now. Just get the aggro and I'll drop the drones then. And that's for them. Boom. Another spawn. Just saw it then. The diapithems are little kids. Yep. They're the uh, culprits. Not dropping the drones. I've not got a lot of aggro, to be honest. Let's just keep killing these. They're not getting a lock yet on with the um, with the jamming. We're jamming. <laughs> Tough little cookies, these. Ah, the Gila. I love that ship. Love the Gila. Yeah, just love everything about that ship. Looks sleek. Evil. Awesome. And I'll be dead in a minute. Jammers out of the way. There we go. See you later. Get one each on these. These lights not even locked me yet. Now they are. Right, I've got all the aggro except that extinguisher. Well, let's lock him in. Let's get, the, let's get the drones on the lights. But I need to kill this one next because he may. He'll probably aggro. Ah, he's aggroing the, uh, the drones.
Let us have him. Sweet. Let's get him on him. my drones he's dead now that's good another spawn I'll get this big boy I'm gonna, dr I'm gonna bring the drones back because they will be primary his ass that's it, three salvos gonna reload I've got all the aggro, I'm gonna drop the drones again let's get him on these they're up close and personal, which is uh, not a bad thing. There we go. Let's kill them. Let the drones do their stuff. I think this is the last. This is the last um, spawn that's just come in. He says. Sweet. Let's get that one. Shields. <laughs> Hey, Carl. You all right? How are you today? Just doing a little mission here with uh, with a top top fitted uh, rattlesnake. And I love it. It's awesome. Enjoying your coffee. I've just made one. Yeah, I'm really, yeah, really good, mate. I just made a coffee earlier on for me and my missus. I bought one of those coffee machines not too long ago. Brilliant. Bean to cup. It's just great. You can't beat them. Smells like a Starbucks in our kitchen. <laughs> Yeah, so um, the rattlesnake, I've changed it completely from what I had. It's now a passive, uh, passive fit. I am on a 500 mm microwatt drive, just X. It's actually cap stable. Yeah, you do. You always get the same thing, yeah. I love it. I really do. Um, yeah, it's cap stable on that. It's a good... Let me let me bring it up. I think it's six minutes, six and a half minutes on the... On the... Um, no, 4.42 has changed. So four, four minutes 42 on the repper, which is very easily controlled and I've just done the uh, pirate slaughter which is 8,600 um, loyalty points so it's a big it's one it's 
one of the big ones. And he, the, the ship has just been amazing. Absolutely amazing. She just, she just eats them for breakfast. Uh, the big, the battleships, she's been wiping them out in three, three salvos of tops. So the tops, I've got Caldara Navy top launcher, launchers using Caldara Navy scourge torpedoes. So that gives me a damage per second of 1,088. 7,285 kinetic damage, which is crazy. And that is not... It's not expensive. The fit was two. It's two point eight. Two point eight bill. That is not bad at all. Not at all. Torps are not usually good on lights, but the DPS from them is just awesome. I mean, he's right on top of me and he's getting hit. I mean, I know it's not a lot, but he'll die eventually. There you go, look. Next lot. He dead. And that is done. That is, um, I'm really impressed with that fit. I really am impressed with that. I'm going to save that as my top. Best top. And save. <laughs> yeah, it will hurt. I mean, three, three rounds of tops wipe out the um, the obliterators. You know, the ravens and the scorpions just, just unbelievable. Just melts them. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Absolutely love it. Bloody hell, there's a delay on that. Okay. So, mission complete. So, I've sp I spent... I've only got 97,000 loyalty points left now. I spent nearly, s well, 600,000 on the Navy Raven. Uh, and I've sold that. And I bought some other bits as well. Some ammo, you know, the uh, top, the faction ammo. <clears throat> if you have 5,000 normal ammo, you can then just use it on your loyalty points and swap it. Bit of money and swap. You have to have 5,000 at least um, normal ammo, and it'll swap it for 5,000 faction ammo. On the loyalty point thing. Brilliant. Love doing that. Ah, oh, yeah, that's right. That's why I've, um, it's done really well. Look at that. I've got those in. G2 booster. Repair a booster. Ah, right. That'll, um, that'll make quite a bit of a difference. 9%, 15% duration bonus to repair her. What the hell? So armor, yeah. So fifteen percent armor repair and shield booster cycle time. That is why she was doing really well. Even without those, she'll do, she'll do well. Yeah, you can do that, mate. You can do. Um, there's a. Um, it's just in the loyalty store, just in here. Look in the uh, loyalty point store. You click on that. And you look on here, say, oh, wow, great. Say you wanted 
Uh, just say you wanted some some ammo like this, yeah. So you wanted Caldari Navy Inferno crews. All they all they ask you for here, look, is five thousand Inferno, you know, normal ones, and they'll take four thousand loyalty points and four point two million isk off here, and then they'll just swap them. Uh, it's great. It's a it's a good way of getting uh, cheap um, faction ammo. So I've done that with about, uh, oh, what did I do it with? About 50,000, 50,000 Scourge tops, 20,000 Nova and about 30,000 EM. So you can do as many as you want, as long as you've got the loiter points. You can, and you've got the... <clears throat> And you've got the basic ammo, you can do what you want. It's really good. Caldari Navy Kinetic Shield Amplifier. I nearly bought one of those, but I ended up buying the. Um, let's have a look at the. Yeah, it's only 35. And these aren't expensive. Let's have a look. Yeah, so that was 40. Um, but it's passive. But if you look on the market, I bet it won't... Sh oh, no. This is more like it, 10 million. I, I went to Jitter and bought everything. I, I don't look at these prices. But they're um, they're not expensive, those uh, Dead Space passive ones really not expensive at all and you look at that what it's uh well it's given an eater in the um in the rattlesnake it's brilliant anyway mate i am gonna have to disappear i've been on all day where have you been <laughs> uh. even if you see the station when i've got on the station I um I'm usually around, I'm usually doing something else on another screen somewhere. But if you're around just give us a shout. I'm usually hanging around somewhere. But I like to leave the camera on the station. I'm getting more and more people now sort of coming and watching and staying, which is crazy. More people watching my videos, which is great. Just love it. Yeah. So, are you um, are you on now for the night? Are you are you playing now? The I don't know what what time do you normally go off? There's a bit of a delay, mate. To be honest. <laughs> Bloody hell fire. I was snoring my little head off. <laughs> oh dear. Those are the days. But you're a bit younger than me, aren't you? I'm an old man. <laughs> Long weekend. Cool. Cool. Well, enjoy. Uh, I'll be about. I'll be about, mate. You, well, you'll know. You'll see. Are you? You? You're not much older. You're not much younger than me. Flipping heck. That's good to know. Good to know. <laughs> not a spring chicken, indeed. Tell me about it. Oh dear. Right, mate. You take care, uh, and I'll. Um, <laughs> I'll. Uh, I'll see you soon. I might be on later tonight, I might not. Just depends. Just depends what the wife's doing. Yeah. All right, buddy. Take care, mate. And thank you, everyone else who's been watching. Thank you very much. Uh, like and subscribe, please, and watch some videos. That'd be awesome. That's all I ask. Uh, and I'll catch you around next time. Take care, Gam. See you later. See, see you either today or tomorrow, mate. Take care.